Uh, hi everybody. Uh, the reason why I'm making this video is because I bought a Canon laser printer, you know, all in one. Is this one here? Um, if you have the same one and you're having problems um, being detected by Windows 10 in your Windows computer, uh, this is the video you have to watch. I went into the Canon uh, website and I download the drivers. I thought that Windows 10 will do it automatically for me. Uh, the guy that I bought it from uh, didn't have the, uh, the drivers and the disk. I don't think that will help neither um, because all the problems I have in order to have it working with my computer. So I went in different websites and looked for a lot of videos and nobody was able to help me. So I tried to solve it by myself and I'm here to let you know that I found the solution and I want to share it with you. Uh, this is the reason why I'm making this video. Okay, so let me now switch to my laptop. Okay, so what I did was I downloaded the drivers. Okay, um, and I tried to run the software. Uh, um, down, I download from the Canon website and start doing something and I, you know it, it shows like it's doing it for you that installing the drivers but then when you go into the device manager okay you have uh, different uh, question marks that means that uh, the drivers were installed incorrectly as you can see here um, the Canon website will give you a compressed file. I tried to decompress it and with my WinRAR software. So run, I tried to run it from there and nothing happened. So what I did was I went into, um, let me show you. What I did was I make a folder in the desktop, okay, it's right here, Canon drivers, and I decompress, okay, I extract all the files into that folder, okay, right there, you have all the files, but when you look at the file, uh, there's not, none, none of them that says uh, executable. So I try every one of them and nothing worked. I mean, this is being a headache until now. So I went into the device manager. Okay. Went into the device manager. And what I did was Okay, let me make sure I have the whole thing. Okay, right here. Okay, what I did was, okay, before, okay, here, uh, you have a question mark, okay, under, um, under the printer, okay. Now it's not there anymore. So what I did was, I decompressed the files into that uh, folder. Okay, I came back to the device manager because Windows 10 is going to try to install it for you, but it's not going to be able to do it. I don't know why. Okay, uh, this this printer is not compatible with any uh, any Macs, um, any uh, MacBooks or iMacs. So. I don't know why, but doesn't doesn't uh, Windows 10 doesn't install it for you? Okay, so what I did was um, I, I came here, and you're gonna see in this area. Okay, it's gonna show your printer. Okay, Canon 3240, and then it's gonna have uh, an exclamation in yellow. All I have to do is just 
click right side on the it's not really anymore so click on it when you see the the um, printer name Canon 3240 with the exclamation mark uh, point whatever you call it and then right side click on it and says um, update driver and then it's going to ask you well, no, where if you want to do it through the um, website or if you want to do it through a browse browsing a file on your computer and then you look for your folder the Canon drivers okay and then once you click on on um, this file okay and then you click update it's gonna it's gonna solve the problem okay so that that question mark is gonna go away and your printer is gonna be able to work okay so um, that's what you have to do okay so right now you have no no errors everything is fine but I have I mean a lot of headaches trying to solve this problem so remember download the drivers from the Canon website into your desktop okay then make a folder and then decompress okay that file into the folder you just made so the file from the Canon website okay it's gonna be in your desktop decompress it into the folder you just made go into the device manager look for the error on your printer it's gonna be a yellow uh, question mark or exclamation point and then right side click on it update driver and then it's gonna ask you if you wanna go online or browse your computer browse your computer look for that file and after you find that file click OK and it's gonna install the drivers for you that's this is, the only, this is gonna be the only way you're gonna be able to have your Canon image class 3240 running okay so um, this is my solution I hope this helps somebody out there okay and I what I did you know like what you're, what you're doing right now looking for a solution I couldn't find it but I'm giving you the solution for the Canon image class 3240 laser printer all in one you guys have a great day okay and I hope this helped.